I thought it might be fun to break down a few tidbits about how the promo relates to the episode. Like it says, we're going to look at various situations that might put some folks off from using legacy poser content in their irate-driven Daz Studio experience. This can make any figure take on that wonderful Daz 3D actor look, like the amazing Rosie 8. We'll look at how to quickly render crowd scenes that can be used over and over for other projects. In many cases, using 20 of Predatron's low-res figures is roughly equal to the density of a single high-resolution figure. Rendering them can be even faster. The Creative Cart Exploring fun and creative ways to expand and use our Daz 3D content libraries. I'm really loving this series. I mean, this is the kind of stuff that I really love to do. Show folks my simple and fun methods of working in Daz Studio and let the magic behind the development team take care of the rest under the hood. This is using Mystic Shard and Simon WM's Annie Block collection for the Millennium Subdragon. Here, I have Lorenzo Lorez character climbing Predatron's endless stairs scene using Annie Blocks from Bone Tech 3D. fantasy princess armor in Gangrel's cave with some action VFX elements for the fire. The awesome Angor. Predatron's dead forest scene. Goblin with goblin fantasy armor. Troglodyte with fantasy armor. The full res Dimon Cornuto. Predatron droid in Predatron's trash stash scene. Droid commander. Quick Grovebrook run. Predatron's Industry One scene kit. I used a fire escape prop from his city streets, and this is the 14MU monitor bot. 1-4-MU workers, male and female, in the 1-4-MU link chamber. Here, I'm cycling through just a few of the shapes and face materials, but there really is no limit to the different characters we can make just with the included dials and materials. With just a few dial adjustments, I was able to quickly make this writhing motion on the giant fantasy snake. And she's had enough of that. Predatron's scenes are just amazing. So imaginative. More crowd use and having fun animating. And I use my secret agent Lorenzo to bring a reflection into her eye. Hey there, this is Dartan Peck. I thought it might be fun to break down a few tidbits about how the promo relates to the episode. <laughs> 